Hello and welcome to New Hope for Today. My name is Pastor Andrew Heiss, and I'm the pastor at New Hope Friends Church in Goldsboro, North Carolina. Something that we hear a lot about in our news cycle, something that lots of politicians talk about all the time, is our American national debt. Now, as of just uh, checking it not very long ago, we're well uh, over $27 trillion in debt in America. And that's just the national uh, federal debt. Uh, it, that's a lot of money. <laughs> that's more than uh, a couple of the richest people in the world's uh, net worth combined. But the thing that actually is even more concerning to me is, is not just our national debt, but also how much consumer debt we have uh, per household in America. One study that I read said as of quarter three in, uh, in 2020, uh, the average household in America was at least $140,000 in consumer debt. That's a lot of money. I mean, that's a ton of money in, in mortgages and auto loans and, and all these sorts of things, uh, even credit card debt. I mean, it's tons and tons of money. And maybe you're somebody who is a, is some someone who is in deeply in debt, and, and you owe a lot of money. I don't know, uh, but whatever your situation in it, it, situation is, wouldn't it be so nice if someone came along and just canceled all your debts, paid them all off? I mean, that would be awesome, right? Think about if somebody I don't know, some random person who has tons more money than even Jeff Bezos has, came along and said, you know what? I'm just going to take care of the U.S. national debt. It's, it's good. It's gone. I mean, that would be something extremely crazy. Well, you know, the Bible talks about this very idea uh, when it comes to the sin debt that we have against God. In Colossians chapter 2, uh, part of our reading plan, and I want to encourage you that if you have not... Uh, gotten uh, our reading plan. We actually are, are done with the first side. We're on to the back side, and we, we're starting in Colossians this week. We're going to read Colossians and 1 Thessalonians. Now is a great time to jump right back in and continue reading. But in our reading plan there in Colossians chapter 2, it talks about debt, but it talks about a debt against God, a debt that we owe to God because of our sin. And it says something really amazing here. It says, in verse 13, and you who were dead in your trespasses and the uncircumcision of your flesh, God made alive together with him, having forgiven us all our trespasses by canceling the record of debt that stood against us with its legal demands. This, the, the record of debt, he set aside, nailing it to the cross. You see, what Jesus did on that cross was to take the debt that we owe because of the things that we've done, the, the way that we've tarnished uh, the image of God that is in each of us uh, through sinfulness, through pride, through all the things that we do. The way we've taken what God has given us and so uh, done terrible things with it, we owe, because of that, a debt. And that debt is a debt that we can never pay because we can never Unsin, we can never take our sin back. But what Jesus did is he took all of that sin, all of the sin of the world. I, I maybe even think of my own personal sin. And probably in my own life, I've accrued way more than $140,000 in debt against God when it comes to sin. And maybe you're the same way. But know this today. Jesus paid that debt in full by dying on the cross. So today, you may be living in debt, physical debt, money debt, and that debt causes you to live in a certain way. It causes you to not be able to spend as much money, not be able to borrow money, that sort of thing. But we should no longer live like we are in debt to, uh, to our God because Jesus Paid it in full. What a freeing thought on this day. Live in that freedom, the love that God has for you today. And don't live shackled by the debt of your sin. Because Jesus paid it all.
New Hope for Today is a video devotional released on Tuesdays and Thursdays, which is recorded by Pastor Andrew Heiss of New Hope Friends Church. New Hope Friends Church is located in Goldsboro, North Carolina at 4451 U.S. Highway 70 East. New Hope for Today. Strength for today. Hope for tomorrow.